As you know, homelessness is a real issue in America. Year over year, there's 20% more homeless on the street. Thank goodness we have people like Tiger out here making a difference with a mission. Let's go in and see what we're doing today. Hi, Tiger. Hello. So good to see you. Good to see you, Leslie. So good to see you. So tell me a little bit about what you've got going on today. Uh, well, today is a sort of party for the Suit Up Center. For everyone from the street, so that's homelessness, all the way through first job, veterans, and then, um, as you see, a bunch of college students around here, uh, helping those engage in the workforce. And so a Suit Up experience, like in a public school, help a high school, or in a university, that's where we'll bring in the students, get them to hero school, and then after that, we provide thousands of suits for the attendee students wow. so they can then get ready in conjunction with a job fair. Fantastic. So within 24 hours, like 250 people get clothed, suited, hired. You're really inspiring. This is fantastic. Yeah. Who do you have helping you today? We have, I believe it's like the entire UNLV swim team. And Is that the I, I guess some, swim team in I here guess today? some divers too. <laughs> and uh, but they have been incredible, incredible. Plus we have our our core, you know, we call them next gen hero school for the charity, which is uh, we have Laquan and Vanessa, I don't know if Taylor's here, but um, wow. it's fun to see Laquan because he speaks now and does nearly every hero school today. It's it's pretty awesome. I originally met Tiger when I was in middle school. He came out to speak for my middle school and he asked who's the most important person on the basketball team. And I answered coach and he said, you know what? That's the $100 question. So he gave me $100 and kind of changed my life to be honest. I ended up breaking my neck my senior year of high school playing football, was paralyzed from the neck down. I uh, started walking again and was working with another nonprofit when I had the pleasure of bumping into Tiger for the second time. And uh, when I bumped into him, I introduced myself. I told him that he gave me $100 in middle school. So after that, I asked him to be my mentor. And he said yes, and that was about seven years ago or so. And so since then, I've been working with him in hero school. So do you feel that you've gotten out of hero school enough that you could mentor someone else? Completely, absolutely. Obviously, you know, you've got people that donate suits and you've got your sponsors with your food intervention. And I know people really want to know how they can give back and how can they make a difference. What is it that you're in need of right now? I think right now the, the most important thing in this community particularly is to do more of these breakthrough academies, right? The, where the people are at. So, so what yeah, do you we need? need people to sponsor these. Okay. And so they, uh, there's sponsor portals at heroschool.us at uh, the website. And um, yeah, but the more we do, and maybe they'll come up and they'll say, yeah, we know of an apartment complex. We'll sponsor one for those people. Okay. And, uh, and so they can just steer them around the school, they go around the neighborhood, uh, or around where pockets of people are struggling in homelessness year after year. Wow, you guys, what a great day we had today here at Hero School. I want to thank everybody again for coming out and supporting. You heard the man. The only way he can continue to make an impact with homelessness is by monetary donation. Please visit him at heroschool.us. Anything that you give will make a huge difference for him. Come out to some of these events. You will not be disappointed. I'll see you guys again soon.